The Wired Lab at Duke University is a group of faculty, staff, and students committed to exploring the transformative potential of digital technologies for studies of art, architecture, and urban spaces. We've designed a series of courses that combine traditional art history with technology. For example, in the introduction to art history, we have students mapping the origins of the raw materials that we use in some of the great works of ancient art. By creating maps, our students begin to think about not only what works of art were made out of, but where those raw materials came from. They also, however, begin to think about the history of collecting. Why is it, for example, that certain great works of art are found in museums, such as the Louvre or the Metropolitan one project that we worked on uh, was leveraging the Brummer collection of the National Museum of Art where uh, we uh, traditionally have had these statues hanging uh, decontextualized on a white wall uh, without any sense of their original context and this project uh, aimed to recolor these statues using light and provide museum goers with the opportunity to understand that these statues were polychromatic, that they were colored often garishly, uh, had a much different history than what we might see by just glancing at them in the museum. One of the things that's really unique to Wired is we've built this idea of undergraduate students participating in these long-term research projects uh, as part of the curriculum. The project I'm working on is, in general, um, involves multiple uh, undergraduates, graduate students, and um, faculty members working both in the United States and in Italy, collecting data and images to enter uh, onto a database to kind of collect in one specific you know, formatted appropriately website dealing with the cathedrals and monasteries of southern Italy. Wired is this amazing place where we have art and architectural historians along with undergraduate and graduate students, multimedia analysts, visual and media studies, uh, faculty all coming together to make things. And what we make are stories about the past. We're very interested in using visualization technologies along with the historical content to really do that.